Welcome to another edition of Between Two Ferns, and my guest today is Matthew McConaughey. Good to be here, Zach. Of all the things you can win an Oscar for, how surprised are you that you won one for acting? Here we go. I noticed that you're wearing a shirt. Is everything okay? And you have a major leak in here. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Let's see what's going on with these guys. Oh, dude, don't do that. Really, turn the sprinklers on. You killed Matthew McConaughey. He's dead? He's brought back to life, but he was momentarily dead. You owe me. Go across the country, get 10 more episodes of Between Two Ferns. 10, your dumb internet talk show, and you give me a network talk show. I'm a white man, and I'm straight, and I deserve it. Green as ever. Is the width off to you? We're taking Between Two Ferns on the road. My guest today is Benedict Cumberbatch, but Benedict Kemp, Benefit Lumberjacks. Uh, Bene Benedict Cumberbatch. That's what it is. I read online that you're very private and declined to answer questions that make you feel uncomfortable. Is that true? And how old were you when you got your first period? Um. Bradley Cooper co-wrote, directed, and starred in A Star Is Born. I hear it's great. Are you hoping that will open doors for other hot idiots? Uh. I don't know if I'm gonna get these shows out. We don't have any money. Oh We're God. hungry. We're gonna order the clam strips. How big are they? Have you ever seen a chicken strip? I've never seen a chicken wear clothes. Here's to the crazy ones. The misfits. And ding dongs. I'm just curious about the pathology behind this. Some people would say we're the crazy ones. But I think we're geniuses. Hello. I love your show. What if we take this upstairs? What about John Fletcher? He's probably at home polishing his EGOT. Is that what he calls his penis? Between Two Ferns, the movie. Is this gonna be, a, is it gonna be in theaters? Not in theaters. Not in theaters.